first strike. Hey guys, Blazin here. Welcome to my analysis on the M319 IGL. The M319 IGL is a single shot break action explosive launcher produced by Mizra Armory and used by the United Nations Space Command, specifically the UNSC Army. This grenade launcher fires 40mm grenades. Due to its simplicity, ruggedness, and firepower, it has been a mainstay weapon in the Army since its adoption in 2263, and has seen several action armed conflicts during nearly three centuries of use, with the Human Covenant War as the most prominent. It proved very effective during the insurrection. Due to the weapon's reliability and power, it will likely continue to be fielded by the Army. The M319 IGL fires high explosive dual purpose grenades. The grenade launcher has two firing modes. The first launches a single grenade. After hitting a surface, the grenade detonates on impact at an opponent or after about two seconds, in which case the grenade will explode after bouncing off the ground once. The second firing mode shoots a grenade that explodes when the user wishes. This is performed by holding down the trigger, which fires the grenade but merely primes it, leaving the detonation contents inert. The grenade will only explode after the trigger is released. This enables the user to lay a trap if the grenade is bounced properly into position, and essentially creates an explosive with a dead man's trigger. This function is also helpful if the user wishes to fire at targets that are farther away than the detonation timer would normally allow. Also, the grenade emits an electromagnetic pulse upon detonation, similar to that of the plasma pistol, that can temporarily disable vehicles and energy shields, but only when used in the manual detonation mode. The weapon utilizes a break action breach loading system. After firing one round, the weapon must be reloaded, much like 20th century shotguns. Seconds remaining. The M319 IGL has a bunch of mixed traits, like a mix of UNSC and Mizrahi Armory stamps on the left side of the gun. The only thing worthy to mention on the right side is this label, which I guess warns you about the electric parts of the gun, like the grenade indicator in the EMP function. The M319 IGL features a hammer at the back and a lever which you flick to the side and that allows the gun to break open to load in a new grenade. A grenade indicator which is only on the left side and finally the gun features rails on both sides, a carry handle on the top right hand side and a foldable foregrip at the bottom front. Something else I'd also like to quickly mention is that this gun does come with a flip-up sight so you can better measure targets at a distance. The M319 IGL holds one grenade in the tube plus 15 extra spare grenades. The fire rate I got was 30 grenades per minute. Reload speed was 1.2 seconds. Damage output and TTK don't really matter because this thing kills in one shot. That includes both the standard and EMP firing mode. First strike. Now as for the blast radius results, the values I got were interesting. Let's start with the standard firing mode just by pressing the trigger. So the full blast radius I got was around 7.54 meters. The shield break radius was around 3.81 meters. As for the kill radius, this is where I scratch my head a bit. As you can see, Jim didn't die despite the grenade visibly magnetizing towards him. This means if you just press the trigger, you have to land a direct hit for an instant kill. Switching over to the EMP blast radius results, I got 8.12 meters for the max blast radius. The 
the shield break radius was 3.3 meters. As for the EMP kill radius, I got 2.57 meters. Funny how the EMP mode has a better chance at killing your enemy versus the standard firing mode, which you'd think would be more lethal, at the cost of no EMP, but oh well. And that's the grenade launcher. Overall, I really like it. So much, in fact, that I think it really should be a staple among UNSC weapons. An excellent versatile weapon that can be used in a lot of situations and worked with a plethora of game modes. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, subscribe if you enjoy the content on this channel, and let me know your thoughts on the Halo Reach grenade launcher in the comments down below. And until next time, peace. Kill spree. Double kill. First strike!